is up guys today it is bfb coliseum and it is random trio which is pretty awesome because there'll be good players because it's bfb coliseum well i'm, <laughs> I'm hoping there will be good players um uh, but there probably won't be um i actually played a single game of bfb coliseum random trio before i did this um video and the loadout was super monkey village and glue so that was a that was a pretty big fail to be honest i actually i did win um, but he died in round four because he didn't get up enough uh, glue gunners. So yeah, as I said, we are against a pretty good player. So Esford, and um, they got 4,220 wins compared to 1,433 losses. Uh, uh, quite a few medallions and a 30th prestige badge and with lots of other badges. A Kur Kurushinko, what? I don't know how to say his surname. Um, but So apparently Marwin is... Maybe Marwin's made a clan? Maybe? I'm going to check clans. Actually, no, I won't check clans after this because it is insanely slow. So we've actually got a boat and boomer. It's pity we don't have farm because that would have been a pr pretty decent strategy, to be honest. Um, but yeah, anyway, so in my last video, I'm sorry if I confuse you guys. Um, I, I know in the title, I changed the title because I realized it was kind of stupid saying uh, with terrible towers and it was the sniper. Because, uh, okay, the, the, don't take me wrong. I had to, I had to bring the sniper because it's actually an all right tower. I ended up not using it. I probably played it wrong to use. I should have started off with the sniper and a glue gunner maybe. Um, I'm not sure. But yeah, the, the sniper is a, uh, is a good tower. So I'm not, it, well, in certain situations. So uh, yeah, sorry if I annoyed anyone there. Um, if I annoyed any of you there i my comment i just repeated myself twice in a row i'm sorry about that guys so let's get the boomer there um no doubt i'm gonna be roasted in the comment sections for that so he, he's got exactly the def uh, same defense as us um i think we'll we'll send some blues um just just for normal eco and some pinks on the next round boosted uh hopefully that will cause him some issues because the boat isn't that good i mean um, with the upgrades he has, it is, it's pretty good, um, but I think that some of the, the pinks may go through. I just want to get a few lives on him, to be honest. And it does look like we're going to get a few lives on him, although he did road spike it, and he's getting up another boat. Um, I'm going to get up a glaive thrower, because as you can see, its arc around that bend is actually pretty good. Um, it's going to get quite a lot of popping power out of that, so pretty pleased with that placement. I think maybe I'll set it to, if I set it to last... You can see that it actually runs out of popping power because it's popped its... I'm pretty sure the Glaive Thrower is 13 pops. Uh, correct me in the comment section if I'm wrong. Because um, I don't know everything about the game. I've been playing... I've been playing BTD for like 10 months, almost a year on Battles now. Um, but on BTD 5, I started like 2, 3, 4, maybe 4 years ago. I'm not sure if, <laughs> even if it was out then. But I started playing it goddamn early. So... For some reason, he was sending blues when he could send greens for quite a long time there. Um, so hopefully we're a little bit ahead in eco. I know I'm sending some space balloons as well. Uh, I just want to get some lives off him. But no, it doesn't look like we're going to get any lives off him. He's going to get another... Um, he's going to get the boat up to the one... I think it's a 1-1? One, one? Yeah, it's a, I think, yeah, it's a 1-1. One, one. Um, so one on each side. So it's going to be yellows on the next round, which will be pretty problematic. So we're going to have to get something up here. Um, I don't. That was probably a waste of money going for that sonic boom. Um, I was going to go for the bionic boomer, but then I kind of thought that may be a waste of money, to be honest. So I think I'm just going to go for a grape shot um, and faster shooting boat. Seems to do the trick. And let's send. Let's layer some blue. So. Uh, we'll send two of those, two of those, and then some yellows on top of that, just so they layer even more. And he's actually going to boost us some yellows. But are we are we even going to have to boost this? I Are we going to have to boost that? Um, I'm going to not boost that. Okay, no, I'm going to boost that. No, just as he ended the rush, I had to boost. Oh, god damn it. That was probably his intention. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to send a region lead. And then a boosted pinks over it because he won't have an energy. And hopefully he doesn't have that much money. So let's see. I think this is going to do quite a lot of damage actually. So he's going to get the bionic boomer up. But is that quick enough? And yeah, it does look like it's quick enough. He's going to leak quite a few lives there. More than half his lives. He's still leaking because of all this lag. But no, he's okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to send a couple of camo leads. Because that will force him to get up a cannon ship. Uh, let's get some... Crow's Nest going on those ones. And if he sends an all-out rush, of course, I'm going to get the turbocharge ability up. And I'm going to send him, um, I'm going to send him a, a decent-sized regen rainbow rush. Because uh, he's going to have to boost those regen rainbows. Yep, he's going to boost it. 
And actually, with the boost, is he actually going to be... No, he's going to be okay against that. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to sell this and I'm going to send... I'm going to send those. Uh, oh, no. Oh, he's rushed us. He's rushed us, guys. No, who's going to die first? Is he going to die first? He's going to go... He has to go down first. Oh, my God. That was, that was really close. That was really, really close. Um, oh, my God. So we did actually end up winning that one. And I am going to give him a rematch because he's a decent player, yeah. And he's actually saying good game, uh, which is nice of him because some people just get really salty when they lose and they just exit immediately. But no, I'm going to give this guy a rematch. He deserves it. Um, to be fair, it's random trio. You know, you don't know, you don't know what's going to come up. It's random trio. Like, you have to think on your feet what rushes to do. And I almost died there. That was really close. So... Attack Shooters, oh, that would have been so good. I really like those towers. That would have been pretty good. So, <laughs> indoor pools, random trio. I mean, we've got Engineer. We've got, we got Mortar. It's probably, someone's going to end up winning um, uh, from a camo exploit, I reckon. Because uh, you can get, you know, you can get the um, the Mortar up to camo detection. And you can get the, 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 the foam on the Engineers. But, you know, camos are still going to sneak through. Because it's Hydro Dammit. I mean, this bit, I, I can't show it. Actually, no, I can show it. This bit here is a good place to um, put your mortar because it covers quite a large area. But still, it's not, it's not, it's going to let some camos pass. Um, so that's probably going to be the end of that game. Uh, also, all out rushes, like you can't, what, what do we have again? Yeah, mortar and bomb combo will just regrow them because, you know, the mortar, the burning stuff can hurt black and zebras uh, and rainbows. Uh, and, the, the, you know, the blacks and the zebras, uh, for the bomb as well, it won't be able to pop them. So, it's, it, basically, you'll lose um, if you do that. I'm, I'm pretty sure, anyway. So, let's get up another sentry gun on that one. Keep on sending some blues. I, I'm not going to bother sending any pinks because it's obvious that we're going to be able to defend them. Actually, no. I'm just going to send one set to see if they uh, would actually... Two sets to see if they actually go through at all. And it looks like, actually, yes, they do go through a tiny bit. And we're leaking some lives here. Oh, my God. <laughs> How are we leaking some lives with these? This many sentry guns should not be leaking. But then again, it is Hydro Dam. You, what are you going to expect? It is such a short map. I oversent tons on those pinks. But it looks like it's going to do its damage. And he's actually going to leak lower than us in lives. No, he's not. Actually, no, because he's using his he's using his road spike. So he's going to be fine. Uh, so I'm going to send a couple of blues and then some pinks over it. And then we'll send some black. No, we'll send some pinks to make him chase. And then send some blacks behind it. See if we can get any more lives damage off him. I just want to be higher in lives than him. And it looks like we will get a few lives on him. So he is on 102 lives. And he's actually going to boost some uh, some blacks at us. Uh, but I think with our engineers, we'll, we, we will be okay with this rush. Let's just get up another one of these. Uh, and it, oh my god, no, we are, we are lower in lives than him. I'm gonna send him a couple, oh no, it's yellows on the next round. <laughs> it's yellows on the next round. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sell that. We don't really need that. I'm gonna get a mortar up here for the yellows. Get it, get it to Bernie stuff. Um, so yeah, we're gonna be completely fine against the yellows. Because this, this mortar spot will suffice, um, for them. So you can see he's sending the yellows. But the mortar spot is pretty good on this map. And we'll be fine against the yellows. I'm saying that, but we are leaking quite a few lives. That's actually not that good. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to send a couple of those and then boost some yellows on top of that. And we want to try and get an energy out of him or at least him to get up. Oh, yes. So we get the energy uh, and now we'll send the regen. Actually, no, we can't really do that. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do because he can defend. He has a decent defense over there. Um, uh, let's just get a cannon here. Uh, and set that to close and wait not strong. I can't I can't I can never uh, I can never do the settings on that um, We'll get signal flare uh, and burning stuff. How is he gonna go about doing his camo detection though? How is he gonna do that? So if he sends camos Wait, wait, we can just kill him with cam. What am I thinking? Um, ah, no, don't kill me camos. Don't kill me. So okay these regens they're going through his defense and we're gonna take the win the camo pinks, not the regens. If I called them regens, I always call them regens when I'm commentating. I'm sorry. Um, so maybe we can... Should we play them again? Nah. Good, I mean, he's saying good game. I'm going to go. I'm going to find a new opponent. I think one rematch is enough. Um, but what I like about random trio is you have to think on your feet. You have to be quick. Your reactions have to be fast. Like, with that, I could have easily died. 
Um, because my micro is pretty poor, but I, I think I have all right uh, knowledge of the game. Pardon me, sorry about that. I think I have all right knowledge of the game, not compared to some people. Like, Marwin has played thousands upon thousands of games. Like, I don't even know what his battle score would be. Something like 400,000 or something. Um, someone work it out. I can't be bothered. Um, and I'm probably not good at maths enough to do that. And apparently I'm not good enough at English because I said that wrong. Um, interchange with these towers. I don't want ninja. Ninja is too easy. Um, it's too easy. Water resorts and we got those towers. Um, camo detection is going to be an issue because the engineer always lets me down. I always lose with engineer against camos. Every single bloody time I lose. Um, so this is going to be interesting. Will I win? Will I win this? Probably not. So honestly, I don't know a good. I don't know a good spot on this map for the for the boomerang. I think you can get better spots on the other. I, I think I'm just going to put it there because it kind of loops around there a bit, and he's going to put it there, right? So I don't know. His spot's probably a bit better than mine. I I'm really bad at placing towers. I admit that. Like some people in the comment section of my last video, um, some idiot was like. Oh, oh, yeah, so Wiz Farm Chipper. He spelt Wiz wrong, by the way, and he spelt Chipper wrong as well. Um, <laughs> he was like, oh, yeah, the, the, the Red Mage, uh, the, the Red Wiz and the Chipper cannot defend Moab. You are stupid and bad at the game. <laughs> it's like, if, you, if you're going to say stuff like that, then uh, firstly, I don't care. And secondly, like, seriously, the, the, the Red Mage, I, I mean, fair enough. If English is not your first language, then fair enough. Uh, but of course... It can defend a mob. I'm just bad at the game, uh, which is. But that he he wasn't trying to saying it in that way. Um, I can't really explain it right on the spot. Uh, but it was pretty stupid to be honest. I would put it on the screen. Uh, but sadly, with my editor, I can't overlay images onto a video. I know it's really annoying. I can't do anything. So like for Q and A videos, Voltrix does amazing Q and A videos because he can actually overlay the questions onto the screen, like most people can. Uh, but with Windows Movie Maker, you can't do that, which is pretty bad, to be honest. But, you know, I've, I've learned to, like, deal with Windows Movie Maker. And I think my videos are alright quality. Um, they're kind of good quality, I guess. I guess I would watch them. I, I never used to want to watch my videos. But I'm thinking if I was a different person seeing this channel, I probably would subscribe, to be honest. Because, um, you know, there aren't that many Bloons. Like, there used to be tons of Bloons channels, like Pro Boardlands Gamer, Candy Sun. Zerd, Gaming Shaft, they all don't upload anymore. It's just like me, Boltrix. Lemo quit as well, which is really sad. I don't know why Lemo quit. I imagine it's just family issues, uh, but don't take my word on that because, you know, I, I, I have no idea, um, but I'm assuming it's stuff to do with that. So he's sending me some blacks, so I will get a... No, I won't. We're going to be fine against blacks. Uh, yeah, we didn't leak at all there, so the, yeah, that's good. Um, we'll get an... Actually, yeah, we will get an engineer up. Um, and we'll set that to strong. If you set the engineer to strong, uh, the sentry gun set to strong as well. That would be pretty useful, to be honest. I think Ninja Kubi should do that. Because the sentries aren't there long enough for it to matter, really. Uh, so, no, it's set to first. Rip. Rip that, then. Uh, let's carry on sending. Uh, maybe you send a few region li whites, actually. Uh, I mean, someone said that the, the cost of them isn't really effective when you're playing Wiz Farm Chipper. Um, because, you know, the, the opponent only... You, you spend more on the rush that the opponent spends on getting defense. But it looks here like it's actually doing quite a lot of damage. And layered with the yellows. Yep, he actually leaks some lives there. And I'm I'm lower on lives, but I'm not too fussed about that. So, he's, he's sending the crying emote. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. Uh, we need to get this cleansing foam up ASAP so we can defend. I reckon one of us is going to die to camos. It's inevitable. We're, we're going to die to camos. We, we just are. We're going to die. We're going to die to camos, guys. So, let's get the cleansing foam up there. Uh, we need to get at least another one there. Um, but we don't even have the money, which is pretty sad. Like, we need more money right now. So, yep. Is he going to rush us with camos? Um, I'm going to I'm gonna energy that straight away. Get the camo section up. Ah! Ah! No! Oh, my God. The spikes. They, they, they failed so much there. Um, so, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go all out, guys, with camo pinks. He may be able to get the boomer ability. Uh, but when he... Yeah, he's going to get the boomer ability. Uh, and he boosted as well. So as soon as that runs out, I'm going to... He needs to rush me right now. So I'm going to send him a few region whites. Um, make him rebuy that ability again. And you know what? Actually, wait. I need to... Oh my god, am I going to die? I can't die to that. Oh my god. I swear to god, voice breaks. But no, he's going to defend that. So, yep. 
GG. I can't. There's no. There's nothing I can do. I I played that pretty poorly, to be honest. I'm sorry about that, guys. Um, so yeah, this has been a pretty short video, only 15 minutes long, but I think three games is enough for one video. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I do think my commentary was the best this time. I don't know why. Um, well, I maybe maybe because I just cut my hair. Well, I didn't cut my hair. I just got a haircut. Uh, I'm just gonna look at the clans quickly. Um, see if Marwin actually has a clan. But yeah, I just cut my hair, and literally, you know when you cut your hair and there's still hair left in your hair um, from the cutting. Um, <laughs> Well, basically, it's falling onto my phone, so I always run my um, run my hands through my hair when I'm recording. I don't know why. I just do it. It's a habit. Um, so, yeah, yeah, so Marwin has a clan, apparently. Interesting. Um, let's see what kind of players are in there. Uh, we'll see, firstly, if Marwin's in there, because it could be a fake clan, but I'm probably not. So, yeah, Marwin, oh, my God, 80,000 keys. Oh, my God. So, yeah, that's him. That's him. We've got Zao YT, um, Milton, Eric. Lots of people that you can recognize. Just too bad at this. Uh, I remember when I beat him with boats. Uh, but yeah, not many people in the clan. But it's still fifth because, you know, Marwin grinds so much. So yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. See you in the next one.